Line spacing in Word refers to the space between lines and the space between paragraphs in your document. Just the right amount of space can increase the readability of your document, so it's important to get it right. You'll probably find that the default spacing in Word is good for most documents, but you need to know how to change it when necessary. We'll first look at controlling line spacing using the line and paragraph spacing command. So first of all, let's select this paragraph. Here's that command. Click on that. Um, immediately it shows us what the current line spacing is set at. And it's currently set to 1.15 and that's the default in Word 2010. Uh, also we can change it to 1. And as you can see, it's now looking a little cramped. 1.5, 2, and the spacing's gradually getting bigger and bigger. That was line spacing, but let's move on to paragraph spacing now. When you press enter to start a new paragraph, Word automatically puts space in between the old and new paragraphs. We can demonstrate that by breaking up this existing paragraph by placing the cursor here and then pressing enter. Now you can see that there's a space in between the old paragraph and the new one. To change the paragraph spacing at a basic level we can use the options on the line and paragraph spacing command like we saw before and we'll just select those two paragraphs go back in and down here you can see add space before paragraph and remove space after paragraph and just hovering over each of those options gives us a live preview so we can see what each does. That command just gave us a basic level of control but if we want a little more control we can go back into that command and this time choose line spacing options. On this side are the paragraph spacing options, whereas this side holds the line spacing options. Now, just to demonstrate, let's change the the spacing before the paragraph to be uh, 20 points, and the spacing after the paragraph to be 40 points. <coughs> and we'll just click OK now. OK, well, Control Z to undo that and we'll go back into the spacing options and notice back to the line spacing options you just get um, increments of 1 to 1 1.15, 1.5, 2, uh, 2.5 and so on. If we, if we go into the line spacing options you can see for line spacing you can actually specify a specific um, line spacing for example 1.23 and click OK there we go.